Well, hi guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I uploaded the other video, finally, of my haul. I don't know why it wasn't letting me upload it. The first one I did was too long, apparently. Um, which, I don't know. Anyway, so the other one uploaded, but I totally forgot that um, my mom and I had gone to Value Village, which is um, like a secondhand store here in Canada. I think you guys have it in the States as well. I'm not 100% sure. <clears throat> but I think you do. Anyway, so we were just um, walking around and I came across um, these bags of wood stamps. And they were only $1.99. So I picked up four of them. I kind of, you know, struggled to see what was in them. And there were six of them, but the other two weren't that crazy about or what for whatever reason. So I just picked up these ones. Now, every stamp in here I'm not crazy about, but in each bag there's at least a few stamps that I thought were really good. So I'm going to go through these little baggies and show you what I got. I'm going to try to tilt down. There. Okay. So, let's see. We'll open up bag number one. I have four bags. Let's see. Okay. Open up bag number one. Okay, so... This one, this is from Stampin' Up, sorry, Stampin' Up, I think this one is from Stampin' Up too, these ones I think are in a set, but it's not complete unless they're in another bag here, I don't know if this is all from the same person or what, got this one in the bag, I don't know who this is from, I think this is like um, Michael's, I'm not crazy about it, but it will probably go in a for sale pile. Um, this one I love. Look, it's a little pig. Okay. My sister-in-law has a thing for pigs. So I'm going to make this into a Christmas one with a hat and him under a tree or something of that nature. That one. This is from Studio G. This one is from Craft Smart. It's a little chick. Cute. That one I like. This one I like too. It's alright. It's a background stamp. I think this is just like a dollar bin stamp. I'm not sure. It doesn't say anything on it. So probably. And then there's this one from Stampin' Up! And it says Friends. So that was in the first bag. So out of the first bag there are these stamps that I like. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stamps in the bag. And I like six of them. Okay, so let's do the second bag. Open it up. Let's see what we got here. Okay, so we got this one, which is a dollar bin stamp. Eh, not so crazy about that one. This one I love. Isn't it cute? This is from O O P S X. No idea. Never heard of them before, but it's never been used. So I love this one. This one I love. Isn't it gorgeous? It's like a cabin in the woods. This is from Inca de Cadu. Never been used. Stunning. Okay, so it's two I like out of that bag. This is from Studio G. Not crazy about it. But it's whatever. This one I think too is, let's see, oh this is Recollection, and this one I love, I love the font on this. The scripty style, I love it. So that's three I love out of the bag. This is a tiny balloon, and this is from Fudge Studios, never heard of them. It's cute. It's, again, like, whatever. And then this one here is also Hampton Art, and it says, um, wish big. So these two aren't too bad, but so out of the bag there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stamps. Oh, seven stamps. I like three of them a lot, two of them not so much, and two of them are so so. Okay, so that's bag number two. Let's get bag number three. Ooh. Okay, let's see what we got here. We got this, which says thank you, and it's a peacock from Stampin' Up. Eh, not so much. This is Stampin' Up. 
cute like it this one love it very thankful stamp it up okay i love him oh and it says something on the side here too what does it say very what does it say oh very thankful that's the word stamp oh that's cute you can use it separately like that one a lot this one adorable stamping up thank you this stamping up still swirl it's cute and then there's this one I like too. Well, I like the thank you so much part. Not so much this part, but it's separate. So I think I might just peel this off. Throw that away or whatever. Very cute. And the last one was friend to friend. Stampin' Up. Okay, so I liked three of them a lot and four of them. Nah, not so much. But that's okay. For $1.99, not the end of the world. Then the last bag is a bigger bag. I don't know if there's more of the stamps or just some bigger. Oops, bigger. Okay, so this must be from the same seller because I think this goes with these two in this set. This is the um, holly leaves. I like that one. This one's really cute. This is from Studio G. Very cute. I like that one. This is from Stampin' Up. I like that one. This one says, Love Owl Ways. Love that one. This one is too cute, but it's just a basic stamp from Studio G. But it's so cute. Little ladybug. This one, yeah, not so much. Studio G. Ornaments. This one's really cute, though. The holly leaf. Again, uh, who's this one from? Studio 18. Okay, this is from Fudge Studios. Love him. Look, at he's a tiny little owl. Okay, this is Studio G. I have this one already, so that one's going to go. But it's cute. This one, can't stand it. <laughs> Don't like it at all. This is from, it's never been used. It's from, I don't know, it doesn't say. It just says Stamp San Francisco on it. I don't know. Don't like it. It's going to go back. This one I love, though. Here, that's my cat in the background rustling through a bag. It says, "Greetings of the season and best wishes for the new year." Very cute. Love the font, the script. So those are all the ones I got. So not too bad, right? I mean, that was eight dollars worth of stamps, and out of them all, I got a few that I really liked. Okay, just wanted you to see that. Bye, guys.